Is there going to be any extra concrete left there? I don't know, maybe. If you have a little, can we dump it over there where a gas tank's got to go? Sure. Is it okay? Yeah. All right, yeah. thanks. Hey, good morning, everybody. We've got a, about a 40 by 28 house floor we're doing way up here. We're an hour and a half away from the shop. Kind of what we call northern Maine up in the mountains. Pretty easy pour for us, really. It's just a little residential house on top of styrofoam. Got some sauna tubes to fill afterwards. But we should be able to, should be able to blow this right in pretty fast. Take a look! Grab another along. Yeah, go grab another one. He's the right slump, we probably should only need two. Buggy this morning. Maybe he left something off. Rocky today. Give me a good solo effect. Probably enough with this right now. A little bit easy. Well, I think you're down, aren't you? Yeah, if you can. This is sign language for unlock it. Tim. Relax, but I just want to get mixed up. We might know, we know. might have to move him over there to empty him. I don't I don't think he's gonna run out right here. No, no because I ordered quite a bit extra for the sauna tube. Just a tiny bit, wheelbarrow. On track or the hot one? Big one. That was a power buggy. 
<laughs> All right, we gotta move you over, big guy. You gonna put that on or no? I'll put it on when you get back here. Well, you guys are like brothers, you work it out. I'm coming. I'm coming. Now they get me. Not quite so many rocks tomorrow, bud. Okay. You notice how it changes on after it sits for a second? <laughs> and all the water comes up? Yeah. Yeah! How'd the swallow bed come out? How'd what come out? Swallow bed! Oh, came out good! Ain't bad once we get all the rocks mixed in. See, Tim would have had this on already. Tim would have put it on down there. I know, that's what I mean. He's always thinking ahead. Coming down. Other way. Ah. Uh, did a little sweat going this morning? It's humid. Yeah. Must be a smoke from Canada blocking the sun. Lovely. Pull it that way a little, Luke. Get a little bit right there. Back a whisker. Down, please. Give, give me a little bit. We got the boot. Yeah, I'll get right on that. Everything's <laughs> everything's funny, isn't it? <laughs> hey, thanks for coming up all this way. Thank you for coming up here. Hey, you're welcome. Anything? Well, 
Drug down. He did uh, what two thirds of that, so he's gonna finish that. Then he should have enough left for the, all these sauna tubes after. Grab a shovel, he's sort of high down there. We can shovel it right in that sauna tube. It's really muggy out. It's only in the 50s this morning, but it's really muggy out, so kind of. Got a good sweat going on anyway. Probably good for me at my age. <laughs> Strike a little more, don't it? Strike one more. Strike ten more, Tim! There we go. What's he doing? Coming over here? Oh, oh. Frank Grant. All right, that was me Sunday morning. I had a couple of drinks. Mike was that me? Up, Tim. Up, buddy. Over here, Tim. We can get that. Is it, you doing that there? Smorgasbord for the bugs. <laughs> Where are you first? Hold on. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, getting eaten alive. Eaten alive. Lock it right there. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Get, get rid of a little bit. You guys swear a lot, you know that? You profanity. You have a lot of profanity in your life. <laughs> Darren's like, I do too. Can we get that over out of the way for a minute? I will. Just raise your up, he'll be alright. 
How's the mosquitoes down there, boy? I'm sure they're just like up there. What do you want to do, Tim? You want to just set your butt end over a little bit more? I'll back right now. Hey, you can't lack up a hoobie and let it go when you win a screen. Like back right now. You see, okay. I'll get him. Go ahead. Alright. I'm going to take you. Thank you. You want me to lower? Yeah, lower. Get all, all right, he wants to back right down here, so it's stuck, it's on him. Now, the pool went in pretty good. A lot of bugs here this morning. You guys have to, you have to deal with all those bugs like we do. We got black flies. And mosquitoes here in the spring. Can we just not fight, guys? We're gonna come up with a banner to put in your in Why don't your. You back here, man? I'd feel better if you did it. That way the banner's back. gonna say, "Can't we just all get along?" We do all get along. Is that tie is supposed to do that. Those, those turn like that though? Yeah. Wow. That's, is that an advanced model? No. I'm afraid he's going to get back here and he's going to want to jig and he's going to be screwed. Well, if he goes tight, he stays tight, he can jig. I put him right in tight to these rocks with him, Miguel. Okay, buddy. That's up to you. You're the driver. I've never driven one. When do we want to jig? So far. Good job, Tim. Thank God he sent you second. <laughs> wait, out, wait a minute, you were speechless for a second. Well, I didn't hear what you said. You didn't say anything. I didn't hear what you said. I was talking to Rickle. You heard me. What did you say? Nothing. I said you're the best driver we've ever had. He is the best driver. No, you are. No, he is. He's been doing a lot longer than this. You guys are like brothers. Yeah, I lined that right up just right. Not bad. Not bad for a driver. Uh -huh. Then if you flip one, you hit this. Wow. Uh -huh. You got him just the right distance for that. I know. You did all right on that end. I did all right on this end. We're a team. It's like the Patriots, bud. Huh? It's like the Patriots. Yeah. What do you do with that other shovel? Oh, uh, what? Shovel? We had two shovels here. There's one over there. Oh, they'd be out of both load, huh? The second load definitely uh, didn't separate as much as the first load. It felt, felt pretty normal, actually. It's kind of weird how you can back two trucks out back to back and have one so much different than the other. I don't know. You know that first one just felt really rocky. Plug, they plug all the mix designs right in the computer and the computer spits it out goes on the conveyor belt and just gets loaded in the truck so I don't know why it's so different maybe somebody maybe somebody listening knows let me know if you know in the comments why one load can be so much rockier than the other when they're both the same exact mix designs batched out back to back be a little soft getting up over that home right, good good Good! Whoa! Boy out of the way. Ooh, almost got me right in the face. 
Flip All right. Shoot. Take one off. Flip one. Want to do that? Yeah. Before we, we'll be right there. before we get him stuck? Yeah. Before we get him stuck. I ain't gonna get him stuck. <laughs> okay, go ahead and lower that a little. Yeah. Whew. You gonna make him do that all by himself? I mean, no, I thought you do it. Is he tired of holding it? I thought, I thought you had no. I thought you had an orange vest on there for a second. Yeah, I should have one. All this work I'm doing. Run up down. Down a little bit and run up slow, please. Can I observe you doing it? You notice I'm getting it on my hand. You got it on your hand. Probably if we scrape the chute, we'd have enough, but Mike don't feel like scraping. Yeah, that's gonna be just right. Uh, we need just a five gallon pail, Tim. What? Oh, he's got now. Unlock it! Yep, let it go. Alright, four down, four to go. See if we can get him up out of this hole now. Feels pretty hot up here. There's that one little spot where he turns. Right where he is right now. He's got to be able to get his front end over a little more, so I don't know. He said he could do it. He kept that second truck around in case we got to give him a little tug with a chain. All right, let's watch the magic. I don't think it's going to come up out of there. I think it's going to start chattering. You think so? Because of your, because your experience level? Well, that and these trucks are pretty useless. How much is already got it soft and not for the corner? There he goes. Ooh, that was close. He made it. He knew what he got. Uh, I think I can eat crow on that one. Do you have to eat crow, buddy? Huh? Good job. Thank you. <laughs> I can't believe you went up over. No, we're complimenting you. Yeah. Four more. We got her. From here, we're headed probably, I don't know, two, two and a half hours away down on the coast. Right now, we're up in the mountains in Maine. Then we got to head down on the coast of Maine. Finish up a job we've been working on all weekend. Epoxy coating. So, it'll be a good little drive from here down to there. But we've been dealing with so much rain that we've just had to do whatever we can to get something done. Keep everybody moving, everybody happy. Now you know. I think he drank his lunch. Now you know how we feel like, bud. Don't be moving the shoe. That was deep. Holy cow, is that deep? When they get to the top, they want to bend over. Ooh. Buggy this morning. Yeah, about three feet.
Perfect. All right, that does it for here. So Luke's gonna stay here. He'll power trial that, saw it. He'll finish this job off today. Those sawn tubes are done like that. Me and Darren are gonna go finish that epoxy coating. So we'll see you down there. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.